These Celtics might be the best challengers to LeBron's throne yet. Yes, even without Kyrie Irving and Gordon Hayward. To cite last year's embarrassment in the Eastern Conference Finals is beside the point. This team is built differently, and it could have enough to keep the Cavaliers around LeBron in. Check. The Celtics are surrounded by the ghosts of playoffs future and past. It's hard not to wonder how good they will be next season. When Kyrie Irving and Gordon Hayward return, it's even harder to forget how easily they were beaten by LeBron James and the Cavs in last year's Eastern Conference Finals. We may end up remembering this season as a transition year for the franchise. But the team's 4-1 second-round victory over the 76ers who are one of the hottest teams in the NBA, is proof these players are a special group in their own right. Brad Stevens is great, but he's not coaching a bunch of scrubs. They have the players to at least put a scare in LeBron. They don't have much in common with last year's team. Al Horford and Marcus Smart are still the defensive backbones of the team but Jalen Brown and Terry Rozier have taken quantum leaps forward. Everyone else is new. Isaiah Thomas, Avery Bradley, Jay Crowder, Kelly Olenek, and Amir Johnson have all been replaced by bigger, faster, and more versatile players. Those Celtics were overachievers who emptied their tank to sneak past the Wizards in the second round. This year's team has lottery picks at almost every position. Stevens has shifted his lineups several times over the course of the playoffs. But he will likely bench Aaron Baines and move Horford to the five to start Brown on LeBron in the Cleveland series. That would put three no. Three overall picks in their front court: Horford, Brown, and Jason Tatum, and a no. Six overall pick, Smart, and number 16 overall pick, Terry Rozier, in the backcourt. All five are plus athletes for their respective positions. With the defensive versatility to slide around the floor, Boston exposed Philadelphia's supporting cast in the second round. The 76ers destroyed the Heat in the first round by surrounding Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid with elite three-point shooters like J.J. Redick, Marco Bellinelli, and Ersan Ilyasova. The Celtics dared Simmons and Embi to beat them one-on-one. -on -one. And they ruthlessly hunted those shooters on defense. There aren't many places to hide a bad defender against Boston, Rozier, Tatum, Smart. And Brown can all attack off the dribble, as can Marcus Morris. Their first forward off the bench.